open, hopefully nobody smashes into one of them, but they keep their eyes open, they should be all right. since these guys on the way down the track. Oh, Penny Pinchers trimmed out there pretty good, skimming along, as is the head rush. Actually, they look pretty even making the way down there. It's hard to tell going straight away, but... It takes them a little longer to get down the course than it does the uh, big boats here. And the airports. Oh, please. Of course. Better than that. Very good for these little airports. And I'm sure Joe's will be chastised severely. Okay, making the way back. It looks like the penny pincher in the inside lane. 
Hopefully they can see that wake. And here they come, and it is going to be the penny pincher. And it is in the inside lane, the penny pincher over the head rush. Well, looks like Clifford and the boys have got the boat working pretty good today. Outside lane. That's a brand spanking new boat they built this year. And they're a little quicker to the corner. A little slower around the corner though is the Dodge is on his way back. As the Mr. Moat Park gets straight away and headed back. Here they come and looks like the little better corner is going to give the Dodge in. Picking up the wind, and Georgie is... Nope. High throttle a little too far ahead on that one, so we have our first going to... Turn loose! By me walking up going away, you can probably tell better. Side on. Okay, as they make their way to the turn, inside lane, that's the second lane first. He's going quite wide as the half throttle gets squared away and hit it for home. Second wind. He's gonna have to make us the territory, but as we saw in Lane. It's a long way 
ways to be running those big big engines wide open, folks. So we don't want to see anybody who will lose ten thousand dollars with a dead engine, which could happen quite easily. Okay, the boards making the way down. Corner first. Looks like the outside lane has the Firebird. Firebird has been consistently faster than the other boats. Looks like the other boats have a little bit of work to do if they want to catch him. Penny Pincher, he's gained a lot from the first of the year. He's, I believe he gained 10 mile an hour since the first race. Here they come. Coming along, both boats going pretty, pretty even. Beautiful afternoon here in Pugwash Harbor. Couldn't ask for better conditions. And it is going to be the Firebird. Sean Wickens in the outside lane, picking up win over Chris Smith in the penny pen. Send them on the way. Nope. Head rush a little ahead. The type of motor the head rush is running, and he has to keep his ribs up. So it's a little tricky for these guys to get used to. He has to come to the line a little faster than the other two. Yep, George sends him on the way. <laughs> Almost looks like Miles isn't getting up to speed. Sean's just running alongside him. Keeping it close. Putting on a show for you, the crowd. I'd like to thank all the volunteers to make this possible. The NSBRA and the Pugwash Harbor Fest. Everybody making this possible. The boys on the safety boat to the flag boat here. Providing camping facilities and stuff, it's all much appreciated. Okay, as so they make their way back. Pretty even, as I'm quite sure she's toying with him. Brand new boat Sean has there, just built it this year. Nice light boat. Plane's very nice, although they got the hip rush. Playing along pretty good. And photo finish! <laughs> In the exhibition race, a photo finish. Happy with the start? Yes, sir, says the moose. They could possibly get out of them, I'll guarantee it. And once again, they're doing in the low to mid 60s. Okay, to the corner first is the outside lane. End of the turn, Mr. Mopar. The inside lane, I have to making his turn quicker though. Second win. Pick 
Set up the wind. Out of the citation hole, these are made boats. Trigger throws a little corner on the inside, you square it away.
these outboards are all tied, so I believe we're going to race them off against each other one more time to see if we can break the tie. If not... We'll have to go by finish at pick two, and it's Sean picking up the win there with Benny Bencher. Sean... First into the turn, throwing a little water. Pretty even though getting squared away and headed for home. Looks like the inside lane may have a slight advantage. There we go. Making our way back to the line here. It's going to be close. An outside lane picking up the win there. Mr. Mo. Chevy. 
looks a little more promising this time. Balls 
Bitterness. Okay, next up will be Indonesia. So, we've got a boat coming down through the course here. We'll get him over out of the way. Get the course clear. We have two more races, folks. Just stand by. We only have two more races. Then you can steam up and down the highway all you want. Just two more races. I got four of them, so that's the 400 class. The second wind. He's sending them loose. Looks like the second wind, the half throw. Again, the winner there, the second wind with the Watson and standing by. Here they come. Good start. Robins are leaving that flag, and away they come. 70 mile an hour. Fly out. Thank you.